back to another episode of City Skylines. I was just sitting here looking at the uh, academic uh, stuff for the university. And um, <clears throat> it turns out we already maxed out all the uh, academic works uh, for this particular university. So that is apparently something. I didn't know that you could cap it out, but I guess you do. So... And then while I was sitting there, I, a pop-up happened over the screen, and it was like, oh, this building's on fire, and I look in this smart post office, I'm just like, of all things to spontaneously combust, it's the post office, right? So, though we have a fire department not too far away, we have uh, somebody coming already, so, should be fine. It doesn't look like it was the first time that this area's burnt down either. It looks like there's some dead trees still from a last fire, possibly from the same building. Hard to tell. I didn't know this was such a flammable building. Uh, yeah. Okay, so apparently that's a thing. I didn't know. Alright, so today what I wanted to do was our farming industry is doing pretty good. Um, what are we missing for... Next level, we need like 800 workers to get to level 5 on that, so. Um, I think we might have enough jobs, let's just double check. Oh yeah, we have tons tons of availability, we just don't have enough workers, that's the only problem. Okay, so we can expand over into this area, I guess, and uh, we'll see if we can't get... Oh, actually, you know what, we don't, we haven't touched this area. This is, um... That little plateau that I wanted to put a kind of um, uh, city on. So we might be able to do that today and work on this area. Make it nice and beautiful and see what we can come up with for the design. Now I'm thinking maybe um, kind of skyline in the back. Some high buildings and then some shorter ones in the front along the coastline. I uh, might be able to do self sustain self-sufficient buildings. I can't, that's a really hard word for me to pronounce. Um, and maybe some uh, office buildings. Well, we don't really have an office demand, so we might want to go with high density commercial. And we'll see if we can't get that in. Um, yeah, we'll see, we'll see if we can't do that. And then maybe decorate the coastline a little bit as well. And uh, put a retaining wall or something in. So let's start with that. We'll start cleaning up the trees and we'll start working on the, the border and everything like that. Actually change the mode.
well, I wanted to put in the castle. I think it's a castle. Uh, sea fortress. So basically what this does is um, increases the ship and airport traffic tourist uh, capacity by 5%. So basically if we put that in our town then we can get a little bit more um, tourists. So I'm not sure what we're get currently getting but this will definitely help with the um, thing. And I figure we'll put this over here and I started building out the roads and stuff over on this side so we can kind of plan out how we want this um, general skyline to look. Uh, I might end up bringing this a little bit diagonal. I might see what we can come up with for that. Um, I want to make sure that the um, grid's on. Might be too sharp of an angle. I'm not sure. Yeah, we're not going to be able to do it from that angle. Um, maybe one more. We'll go out like that. Go like that. Can we do that? Maybe. Might still be too hard. Oh no, we should be able to do it. Okay, we'll see if we can't do that then. And we'll. Just trying to think what way I want this to be set up. Probably like this. And we'll bring that to here. Bring that up. Bring that up. And then we have a little bit of room over on this side still. Though I'm not sure what I want to put over here. Um, maybe a park or something. What other buildings do we have in this? category. We have the Opera House, <clears throat> Aviation Club, that's probably not going to fit. Um, Expo Center, a little too big. Got, yeah, this is going to block the view. Most of this will block the view here. Uh, what does that give us? Um... Increases the effective radius of all parks and plazas. Ooh. Okay, we might be able to integrate that into our skyline. I know this gets uh, most of this area, so we might be able to put it over on this side. Um, fit that in somewhere. It, it shouldn't affect the uh, thing as long as it's at the back, right?
got um, the road networks all set up. Uh, it took me a while to put in, but uh, I think it will do just fine. Uh, I figure what we'll do is we'll start branching out some uh, roads this direction. We might even want to connect up a few things, a few lines down uh, from these areas so pedestrians can get across a little bit easier. Uh, just so it's a little bit uh, better for them to get to their places rather than having to go all the way like that. They can just go straight up like that. I think that will do be pr pretty good. So um, let's see here. What what can we do for that? We can probably... I'm not sure if these are exactly aligned. They might not be. So those might be. I don't know. We'll have to... Um, Play around with it and see what we can come up with. I'm going to also delete a couple of those. And those don't look like they're aligned either. Um, those ones do, but not the other ones. So we'll just delete all that. Yeah, those look like they're aligned. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and grab the median one. We'll grab that one right there. I got some bus lines in as well. So we'll bring that up to there. And then we'll go back to regular roads so we can create that crosswalk section. And we might even be able to get away with maybe we'll maybe we'll just uh, put another median in. And I'll bring it up to about there. Yeah, I'm just trying to see what will be best, right? We'll connect that up and connect that up. Okay, so that should create some highway systems. We'll have to fix these uh, because the game likes to uh, toggle those on and off. Okay, I'm not sure why it just did that. It's, it's weird. There we go. Okay, so that's fixed. Um, now we just need to get sidewalks up in here uh, so we can get direct lines from the residential area that will be over here. I put some schools and stuff in as well, and there's a retirement home thing um, right on the ocean side, so they have a nice pretty view of the uh, lake there. And there's the crematorium, hospital, and a few other things here.
Alright, so we got quite a bit of stuff done. Uh, we got the, most of the city built. There's still some space at the back here and in this area, and I still need to build the park and probably some develop some area in this general area, but um, for the most part, it's done. Um, we got a nice skyline uh, for most of the angles, actually. So uh, when we start developing over in this area a little bit more, we might even... Um, allow some buildings in this general area next to the park and then just expand the park this way I think we might do that I'm not sure just yet I'm still debating what to do with that particular part but um, I ended up going with a what is it um, self-sufficient buildings which is the kind of like the green buildings I figured that would probably be the best locate like best design for this area and then I went with um, IT buildings and uh, what was it the remember what I put in here <laughs> Uh, let's see if we go to districts. I went with the definitely the IT buildings and I don't think I actually did anything for commercial actually Yeah, just normal uh, Commercial specification so that kind of gives it the medium density in between and that's what you're basically seeing with some of these um, I think that's actually small. That's a large one. It's almost at the max thing but there's tax relief on some of these buildings so they can sprout up a little bit faster. And um, yeah, I'm really happy with the actual design of it. It looks good. So there's a lot of little castles. So we got that. And we still need to integrate the uh, tower somewhere in the background over here as well because we were going to do that and I just haven't found a place for it just yet. Um, I figure we'll get the skyline built first and then we can figure out where we want it but outside of that if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out